Hello Mr. Monty, so this is just my gut response um, review of Robert Cole's empowerment uh, video and basically I just want to start off with saying that Robert took a completely different approach to this assignment. Um, when I first viewed his um, video I was, ex I was expecting to see a movie or something and then like a presentation. I wasn't expecting just to see a whole like um, 10 minute film how he did like with incorporating a voiceover incorporating um video clips of ali and then his short film the what, is, what was it called the flower the, it was called the um flying lotus and i wasn't expecting to see that at all um so all in all he took like a different approach to this video to start off with um the quality of the presentation was really good. Um, he had a clear voice over. You could hear everything that he was saying. Um, also, he did have his message match the content that was coming up, so that was good. Um, everything he said went along with um, what was being viewed, so that was good. Um, and the short clips with Ali in his short film, um, those were really good um in, to incorporate in his presentation <clears throat> from viewing um his presentation i noticed that empowerment the term empowerment is subjective because when i thought of empowerment anytime that i think of empowerment i think of like power or somebody um basically having power and then you wanting to you wanting to do that same thing that's like how i always thought of empowerment like i think of like Oprah Winfrey as a person of power and like of empowerment. I, I envisualize her as being somebody um, to look up to, you know, because she's so big and to, she's, she has done so many things that are power moves. And that's what I always thought about empowerment. But then I actually Googled empowerment after watching this and it says um, from the dictionary online, they define empower, empower as to give someone to give power to someone or to give official authority or legal power to someone so <clears throat> so yeah it's basically to give power is what empowerment means but robert um took a different approach to empowerment which was kind of confusing in a way because in the beginning of his short film he had like he had um, a video clip of Muhammad Ali played by Will Smith and it was an empower empowering speech that he was giving you know it was saying basically about um, about the fight and everything and how how good of a fighter he was and everything like that and it was a very empowering speech but then Robert took a different approach by spinning it into gang violence and black on black crime which I I didn't really understand how empowerment was is connected to the rest of his video after the Muhammad Ali um, after the Muhammad Ali clip. I really don't. I really didn't um, get how that was connected. I was slightly confused to how the short film at the end with like all this blood and death. It was, it, it was very dark, um, it was very dark <laughs> after the Muhammad Ali clip and um, it wasn't uplifting, it wasn't, it didn't, sh I guess he was trying to show that in these black neighborhoods or the, these, not, I'm not going to say black neighborhoods, but I guess in, uh, uh, I don't even know, what, in these cities where it's a lot of crime and stuff I guess that he was trying to say that they have the power of who lives and dies I, I really don't know I was kind of confused by how that went because they the guys that shot the other people passed the first guy and then they didn't shoot him because he was with a kid but then they went and shot his friends that he was with earlier so yeah I don't really know how it fit in but um, yeah, but in conclusion, um, Robert did state that he chose this, the video because, 
Um, to him, it showed empowerment through an unguided journey. So how, that's how I was saying that from viewing this empowerment video, I saw that it's subjective because that's how he felt about it. In his opinion, it was, she showed empowerment through an unguided journey. And then um, he also wanted, Robert also wanted his audience to decode the message of empowerment themselves. And I wasn't really able to decode the message because I was, um, I was slightly confused, like I said, about it. However, um, it was a very interesting presentation and it made you think, like it made me Google um, the term empowerment to see what it meant. It made you think outside the box. So um, all in all, I give Robert um, a good, a good overall, um, good overall, he did good. We did a good video. <laughs> um, it was very interesting to watch and to see how he felt about empowerment. So thank you for watching. Bye.